Hey guys, welcome back to Backyard Demolition. Uh, the other day, we had some leftover pumpkins. We shot them up, we used a couple different guns to see what we could do to them. Um, yet, I still have more pumpkins. Not just these four, but I have many, many more pumpkins. So this time, we're gonna try to get rid of them in a different fashion. Uh, it was fun to shoot them, but it kinda got boring after a while. Uh, so this time we're gonna make it a little more exciting with Tannerite. So I got I got five pounds of Tannerite here. Um, not gonna use it all at once, um, but nonetheless, if any of you don't know what Tannerite is, it's a uh, it's it's basically an explosive, uh, mostly legal explosive. Um, you mix uh, two parts together, you break it into smaller quantities rather than a five pound bag. You can shoot it at five pounds, just you want to be further away. Um, but we're gonna do a couple smaller ones, uh, blow up a couple individual pumpkins. And then I think we're we'll throw a big pile together and see, uh, see how much damage we can do to that with what's left over. So anyhow, I'm gonna get this stuff mixed together. Um, I don't actually have Tannerite uh, approved or uh, uh, name brand canisters, so I'm gonna use Ziploc bags. I did look online. Um, it looks like some people have used Ziploc bags before. Um, they're cheap and expensive. All it has to do is hold it all in one place. I think it'll work. You can trust what's on the internet, right? So, I do believe it'll work. I'm going to try it out. I mean, if you're interested in whether or not uh, Ziploc bags will work for Tannerite, stick around. We're going to find out. If some of you are just interested in watching something blow up, stick around. Because that's what we're going to do. Alright, let's get this stuff mixed up. All right, well, it's all mixed. We got it separated out into uh, a few smaller bags. Um, I got one big bag for the grand finale. I actually took these little old five-hour energy uh, canisters just to see how big of an explosion we can get out of these little things. Um, not expecting much, but you never know. Uh, but uh, yeah, let's go get set up and uh, see what happens. All right, first attempt on the five-hour energy bottle. We'll see how big of an explosion it makes. Well, that wasn't that impressive. Let's go bigger.
Well, there you go. A Ziploc bag will work just fine for Tannerite, for those who are wondering that. Um, I wouldn't suggest put it on the outside of something. You still had to probably put it within something to contain some of the explosion to get a really cool effect. When I had it on the outside of the pumpkin, I just kind of stuck it on there with a toothpick and it basically just blew up right off, off the side. Um, not as exciting as once we cut them open and stuffed it inside. Um, the second thing is uh, it's going to throw pumpkin everywhere. So I was probably 70 yards. Uh, yeah, about 70 yards from at first. But it was less, a little less than a pound. And uh, it, blew, <laughs> it, it blew some chunks right back at me. Um, uh, but the, when I put the uh, like the three pounder in inside and then piled them all up, I got back to about 100 yards. I felt that was a pretty safe distance. Uh, there was still stuff falling out of trees as I was walking up. Uh, it was a really cool experience. Uh, I got I got a lot more of this, so stay tuned, tune in, whatever you want to do. Uh, we got more videos coming up with Tannerite. Um, be safe when you're using it. I did uh, watch a few uh, Tannerite fails. They're pretty gory, uh, so just be safe when you're doing it. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. So like I said, I haven't tried it in a while, and I don't know how to do it. And then I'm gonna shoot this one to compare. 40, oh, yeah. quiet. All right. Everybody, quiet. Okay, quiet. Okay, quiet. Okay, pick that for us. Yeah, we're the ones that are, all right, let's start this one over. It is one. I, I, I shot a bunch, he's going to shoot a bunch, and he's going to have a whole bunch of... They did not work out.